The fight or flight response is a mechanism that our body uses when it's in the presence of something dangerous or frightening. It's a survival mechanism built in us to protect us from anything that can harm us. That being said, the following sounds are meant to induce a feeling of danger and as a result trigger this response. So, here are five scary sounds to activate your fight or flight response. Enjoy. Operation Ghost During the Vietnam War, soldiers who were hiding in jungles heard blood-curdling sounds that were so terrifying that it not only induced a feeling of fear, but brought them into a state of panic. These sounds were actually made by the US military, and it was a psychological tactic that was meant to induce a state of fear in their enemies. With that said, the following sounds are perhaps one of the most unsettling things you'll ever hear. Just imagine being inside a jungle in the middle of the night when everything is quiet and all of a sudden you hear this. It would be a terrifying experience and it would surely induce a fight or flight response, which is exactly what the US military wanted. It was hoped that by playing these sounds, they would terrify their enemies by making them think that the jungle was haunted and therefore cause them to flee out of their hiding spots. If that didn't work, then the latter would. Hearing the voices of their supposed dead ancestors, which were the sounds being played, would trigger them and cause them to come out and fight. The sounds were collectively known as Ghost Tape Number 10, which is no doubt a name so fitting for something so haunting. Japanese Alert System If there's anything that can surely induce a fight or flight response, it has to be the US's emergency alert system which you may have seen on TV from time to time. But something you probably haven't heard of is the Japanese alert system, better known as J-Alert, which is just as unsettling as the US's alert system. The Japanese alert system has a smorgasbord of sounds, all of which are meant to put you in a state of fight or flight during dangerous situations, like there being an incoming tsunami or a massive earthquake. So, here's something you might hear during a disaster in Japan. for someone who's experienced the massive earthquake that struck Japan in 2011, this has to be the last thing they want to hear, as such event must have been really traumatizing. Just imagine hearing a chill-inducing sound coming from your phone, which turns out to be a notification warning you of an incoming tsunami. It would petrify and stop anyone in their tracks, as the thought of this imminent danger would force our bodies into choosing the best possible outcome from either fighting the threat or running away from it. Obviously, the latter would be preferable. But some people end up freezing in situations like this, causing them to be harmed by the threat. Doubtless, this is something you don't want to hear while visiting Japan. An unsettling transmission. The following audio comes from a user on 4chan who claims to have captured something really mysterious. According to the 4chan user, who, late at night, 
was scrolling through various radio stations. He came across a particular station known as WKCR, and while staying on the station, he heard a very strange transmission. Now, it's worth mentioning that he came across this many years ago, somewhere between 1994 and 1995, which would explain the poor quality of the audio. But it is still nonetheless a pretty spooky recording, as it triggers some sort of panic-like response when listening to it. This has to be one of the most unsettling transmissions ever heard on a radio station. But aside from how creepy this is, proving its authenticity hasn't been an easy task for those who've tried. According to Reddit, this may have been an experimental piece composed by a student who worked at the station, as WKCR is owned by Columbia University. Whether it's actual proof of something paranormal, or just an experimental piece, there's no doubting that it induces some sort of fight-or-flight-like response upon listening to it, especially for those who have no idea what this is. Creepy Siren Now, you might be thinking that the previous sound was by far the most unsettling, but wait until you hear this next one, as it sounds like it's something straight out of a horror movie. The following sound comes from a siren that went off in Chicago after sensing an incoming tornado. However, the odd thing about this siren is that while going off, it broke down, which ended up making an eerie sound that spooked the entire city. Have a listen to the sound it made. Just the sound of a normal siren is eerie enough. The repetitive descending tone of the sound is more than enough to not only activate our fight or flight response, but to also leave you feeling uneasy. Doubtless, a sound like this would be perfect for any horror movie. Incoming Attack Perhaps one of the most chill inducing sounds has to be those alerts that we see on TV specifically those broadcast by the emergency alert system. But that uneasy feeling we get upon listening to it pales in comparison to a sound that's notorious for making us feel like something bad is about to happen. And it's a sound I'm pretty sure we're all too familiar with. Yet it's a sound that we would never want to hear in real life, as hearing it would suggest that whatever it is that's coming is too big for us to escape. Here's that sound that's infamous for stopping us dead in our tracks. The nuclear siren is by far one of the most unsettling sounds to hear, and is no doubt good at turning on our fight or flight response. In fact, it is unlikely that we would ever hear this again, as it's been replaced by the current emergency alert system. But if some natural disaster were to knock out all wireless communications, then you can surely bet we would hear this again, if not something similar to it. And of course, you can be sure that our fight or flight response will be activated. 